Many people struggle with being too shallow on their pitch shots. And what shallow is is where you will hit the ground too far behind the ball and the club is actually going up as it hits the ball, resulting in drop kicks, blades, thin shots. And with the help of body track and flight scope, we now can measure how much weight is in each foot and how we're pressuring the ground. And you can see the 70 here. So I'm going to start with about 70% of my weight in my left foot and about 30 in my right foot. Now as I go back to the top of my swing and get right about in here, I do have a slight shift to my back foot, so now I'm going to have about 45% of my weight in my back foot, still 55 in my left foot. But the thing that I want you to really focus on is 99% of my weight is in the balls of my feet on my left foot and 95% in the balls of my feet on my right foot. So the key here is the weight staying in the balls of the feet because now as I come down and come to the impact position you can see I have shifted my weight to get to impact. So there now is more weight in my front foot than at the start. Now there's 74% of my weight in my front foot and only 26 on my back foot. We've heard for years you want to have 75 to 80% of your weight in your back foot. That is true, but the biggie here is where is the weight in regards to uh, my heels versus my toes. So now looking at body track, we can see that I have 70% of my weight in my left foot and 30% in my back foot. But notice 92% in the ball of my left foot and 88% in the ball of my right foot. And as this moves, just look at these numbers and notice at the top of my swing I've got 55 percent of my left foot but 99 percent in the ball of my left foot and that's going to be the really big key here so we move these numbers or move the circles you're going to see that as I now transition to the forward swing look at this number right here look at this 96 that number is going to stay that weight is going to stay in the ball of the foot even past impact. So if you're struggling with being too shallow and struggling with hitting shots thin, make sure that when you hit this ball that you've got more weight in the balls of your feet or the front part or your feet. If your weight is back on your heels, you're not going to be as balanced and very important to have your weight in the correct place. You'll see as this video plays through that I do release the club, my arms and hands rotate as the club passes my lead arm, my weight finishes in my left foot. But if you're really struggling with your pitching and hitting it fat or thin, work on getting your weight more in the balls of both feet. I think that's really going to help you with your pitching. Thanks. For more information, visit my website, LarryRinker.com, or if you'd like to hit some on a body track, come see me here in Florida through May 29th, and I'll be at Red Sky starting on June 4th.